Whoopi Goldberg is saying she's not a fan of cancel culture, recalling the time she was shunned from the entertainment world after what she says was a misunderstood joke about President George W. Bush. While speaking at the Edinburgh TV Festival for the event's International Icon interview, Goldberg mentioned the time her career came to a, quote, gigantic halt after she made a seemingly sexual joke about then-President Bush in 2004. After the infamous incident, Goldberg lost several gigs and did not work for five years until Barbara Walters hired her for The View. But when asked whether she thought she had been canceled, a term that wasn't used at the time, she denied it. No, I would describe that situation as a lot of people covering their backsides because the joke was never about him, but no one ever stood up and said, hey, here's what actually happened, and they put it in the newspaper. And you notice they never seen what I exactly said, or what I said at all, but all somebody has to do is say you said it. Goldberg added, I feel like the truth doesn't seem to matter as much these days. Elsewhere, the comedian discussed her own ceiling-smashing rise as a black female comedian and actor in America, and when asked about the opportunities for women of color elsewhere, such as the UK, Goldberg noted in part, there are boneheads everywhere, so I imagine we're all having the same issues around the world. For more on the story, head to THR.com. And for the latest entertainment news and updates, keep watching The Hollywood Reporter News.